guys and welcome to another adventure story channel video today i have a very nice video for you for those who knows already and don't know what is emergency suction valve okay let's start here as you can see this is from where this emergency suction valve suction what okay this is the question suction water okay and this valve the main purpose it's in emergency case that we have flooding in engine room and the quantity of the water okay as we see with our our eyes it's possible to be discharged overboard we use this kind of emergency suction okay if for some reason we will see that it's the, f the floor of engine room it's already float more than the pump level we cannot do nothing okay it's better to not go down because it's very dangerous okay if the water level is under the pumps you can start the pumps and discharge this water overboard but this is only in case of emergency okay one of the pump maybe it's main condenser pump main copt pump normally it's about number number one okay which is located from starboard side is connected to this pipe and this valve okay and which is the proper way to use this emergency suction valve is first to close the suction of the pump increase the vacuum in the suction side of the gauge and then you need to open this valve okay to be sure that suction will be done also very important is to check that there is no any dirty in the bilges this is the most uh, normal procedure in engine room to clean the bilges to be sure that nothing is inside as better is it's more clean it's more better because if an emergency condition you suction this water all the dirty will go inside to this pipe and why i'm telling this because this water will suction by main condenser copt pump okay and where this pump discharge this pump discharge to the coolers okay that means that if there's any dirty in your bilges everything will be drop there okay and maybe your central coolers will be dirty after but who cares about this is emergency okay we will use even our bilges is dirty okay that's why be careful to not be dirty your bilges and next i will proceed to the next okay here it's some salt we check if we have any leakages we open the valve okay to see if the water coming this is non-return valve non-return valve and then close again lubricate the shaft here check if there are any leakages here okay this is a very very big valve really big valve it, it's weight about one ton something like that okay and this is how it looks from inside okay maybe as you can see there is a rust okay from humidity the water it's trapped because the water as we know it evaporates and go up okay this is for sure the water evaporates and going up the moisture is light and stays up yes and this some pictures this is the valve open okay you can see here that's lifted and also from before okay it's closed nothing's happened water is not coming because it's non return valve it's working properly 
and after this emergency builds suction needs a replacement of the seal okay because this kind of valves emergency build suctions also there is a valve which is direct suctions from the bilge it's always sealed and there is a paper somewhere in engine room or in chief engineer's room that says every valve the location the number of the valve the description and the seal number okay which is very important and the date of seal and also as you can see here there is instructions posted okay here up there must be normally instructions how to start and how to operate normally this is must be for all emergency uh, situation okay one moment please okay i do not have any photos more from here this is i like to tell about this valve keep all the valves all the emergency valves in good condition fire valves everything hydrants must be checked and for the hydrants you must have one angle valve for sure to have one spare and uh, one straight okay because there is two kind of hydrants fire hydrants better to have not two or three of each one type of the valves okay just remember thank you for watching stay tuned more videos coming don't forget to subscribe your comments i wait for your comments and your likes thank you for watching this is adventure story bye bye